saying. You guys aren't educated on how this is a business. And that's why a lot of you won't make it, because you don't understand how it works. Best players play for free. No matter if they're from the hood, if they're from a, a rich family, because what happens in America, it's a business, right? The more kids I can sign up for my team, the more money I make. So I'm going to let the best player play because then he's going to attract A, B, C, D. So I don't think pay to play is the problem. Here's the other part. $3,000 a year to join a pro team. You think that's a lot? Raise your hand. It's okay. I want you to be real. This is where we learn about things. Who thinks $3,000? If your son or daughter is paying $3,000 for the year, do you think it's a lot? It's a mean. $3,000 is a lot. Okay. How much do you think that comes down to a practice? Maybe like less than 50 bucks. Huh? Try four to six dollars of practice. Do you still think it's too much? No. <laughs> this is the problem with the stage. We have no idea about football and how it runs. Now I'm going to do one better. Watch this. Okay, Neymar. Anybody know how much Neymar was sold from Brazil for? Anybody know? 46 million. 46 million. Okay? If in America I could sell players, you would all be free too. Because Neymar played for free, but they made $46 million on him. Now here's, what I, here's the fucked up part. People say America's fucked up, but here it is. $46 million for Neymar. Okay? His youth coach, how much do you think he makes a month at Santos? Probably like 200, 300, like just enough to live. $300 a, a, a month. Because, you know, Neymar was a natural talent, can't say anything, but he helped, right? And he's making $300 a month. So what do you think's wrong? Four to six dollars of practice, or 46 million, and this guy's looking after Neymar and he can't pay his bills? 46 million. So you can't tell me pay to play is wrong in America. Let's talk about that, though. What do you pay for when you sign up for a team? These are good so you know the industry. Both. Yes. League registration, player registration, uniforms, coach's salary, plus a little uh, profit for the club. That's it. So you're paying, you have to pay a player card, right? That's $25. You have to pay insurance for each player. You have to pay tournament fees, league fees, coach's salaries, field rentals, thank you, referees. So four to six dollars a day of practice, I'm sorry. Three thousand dollars is not a lot for the year. Saying you guys aren't educated on how this is a business, and that's why a lot of you won't make it because you don't understand how it works. And I hope you listen to this whole seminar because this is so important. Harry played for my youth team, Marco played for my youth team. If I could sell them to New York City FC and make even a thousand dollars, of course, not, it'd be free, it should be free. But in America, we don't have that luxury, it doesn't work like that. Imagine if I sold Harry at 16 years old to, he's from Connecticut, I sell him to Sporting Kansas City. His mom's going to say, no, he can't go, that's like traffic. I'm not saying your mom will say that, but parents will say, that's like trafficking. You can't sell my player. But in Europe and other places, yeah, he's 16, he goes to train with the team when he's 18, he signs the contract. It's normal. The culture in America is so different. Does that make any sense? Tell me if you disagree. This is what this is about. Did I change your mind on it, Musa? A little bit. What about you, Patrick? A little bit. Did I change your mind on it a little bit? Good. These are things we need to know.